Welcome back, folks. It's official. After University Hawaii offensive line coach Chris Naole didn't make the team's trip to Reno, Nevada yesterday, the five-year Bo's boss of the trenches sent him his resignation letter Friday, ending his tenure a day before Hawaii plays at Nevada. Now, through his lawyer, Naole released a statement Friday afternoon thanking fans in the university while reasoning that, quote, due to certain philosophical differences with the handling of disciplinary matters in the program, I've offered my resignation as the offensive line coach. I've always believed in the integrity and principles of what our community and the university stands for, and those same beliefs are what I have always tried to instill in my players. Now, to read the full letter, you can swing by our website, khon2.com. Suspensions have plagued the Bows this season, with six players already missing game action due to violating team rules or student conduct policy. Now, important to note, any student conduct violations are sent to either the Office of Judicial Affairs or the Title IX office. Those offices decide any disciplinary action in those cases. Now, later this afternoon, the university released statements from head coach Nick Rolovich and athletic director David Matlin thanking Niola for helping transition from Coach Chow staff to Rolos. Now, in Niola's absence, graduate assistant John Estes will take their over the O-line coaching with offensive coordinator Brian Smith helping out as well. Hawaii, Nevada will kick off tomorrow at 4.30. Hawaii's listed as a three-and-a-half point favorite in this one. You can catch the action on the CBS Sports Network.